G'day everybody, Gwen from Grave for a second here and welcome to the latest video update. It is um, Saturday the 30th of March 2024 and it's Easter Saturday. So happy Easter everybody and uh, thanks for tuning in to the latest update. Well, um, yesterday finally we, uh, we released Moment in Time on Good Friday and it was uh, yeah such a great feeling to finally have the album out and um, just have it up on streaming services and YouTube and you know all of those things so and like the, the physical copies all you know pre-orders you know being sent out and everything it was just um, like I've been saying in these updates just uh, I was so looking forward to having it out and you know, you sit on these songs for such a long period of time while you work with them and, you know, you're not sure what people are going to think and um, it's quite a nervous feeling actually. I always find it a bit nerve-wracking leading up to an album release. Exciting, but nerve-wracking. And, um, you know, if the initial responses that we're getting from people on social media and emails is anything to go by um, and private messages, uh, the reaction so far from what I've heard is all positive and um, I'm so thrilled. So thank you to everybody who's like, you know, posted their thoughts on Facebook or sent me an email. Um, I can honestly say I feel like I've had more feedback in the, the day of release, first 24 hours of release for this one than any one I can remember. I think we live in a much more interactive world now than when we started the band 20 years ago. So there wasn't really the capacity back then um, for, the, for the sort of instant feedback that you get now. But, um, you know, certainly the last couple of albums have existed in that world. Um, and yeah, it's just been really pleasing to, to have people um, give their feedback. And what's been particularly pleasing for me is there's been a wide variety of songs that people have, have said that they enjoy. So um, quite a few tracks on the album, you know, via, you know, private message or email or on Facebook, um, people have said, you know, I like this song or I like that song. And it's just really, um, really thrilling to hear that because you, um, you don't know, you just don't know for sure until you get the feedback. So I've actually got, um, this is the album, Moment in Time. There's my physical copy of it. Um, track listing on the back there. Uh, the awesome cover artwork by Ward Silverman. It just, it's just a fantastic looking package. The, the booklet was done uh, and the layout was done by Scott Waters, who is like the, the guru and the maestro of, um, of Christian rock and metal layouts. Um, just, just, really happy with with the way the whole album looks it you know it to me like if I saw this I would think that that's a heavy metal album and that's really what I wanted you know I wanted people to think that when they saw it sort of the, like the cover to tell a story and um because I associate this artwork so much in my own mind with with the music like for example you know when I put it on my um my iPhone uh, to listen to like mixes and stuff I'd have a, I'd ha I used to have a picture of this on my iPhone with my mixes progress mixes so I've for a long time I've been associating this artwork with the um with the music so I, I think it really fits <laughs> you know um, so I'm really happy about that um, one of the ones we've been getting great feedback about is the track Arise O God uh, which is track five um, now that was written by a friend of Tim's, uh, Joshua Sherman. He actually wrote that song and um, via Tim, we got a demo, which we then, you know, we took the demo and we made it into uh, a Grave Forsaken song using um, Josh's original demo. So if you're watching Josh, thanks so much for providing your songwriting um, and blessing us with that track. Uh, it's it's got some good feedback so far. People are people are enjoying that one, and it, it probably is a bit different for Grave Forsaken. Um, so yeah, still it's still metal, but it's like a, it's like almost like a I don't even know what you'd say. It's like a worship worshipful type song, you know. It's like a praise and worship song, but not not it's not like you know church praise and worship. It's still metal, but it's um, 
I don't know. I'll, I'll leave the descriptions up to you. I've, I've heard it so many times that my ears can't distinguish it anymore. But um, it's, it's thrilling. It's actually so good to hear you people um, that you're liking that track in particular because um, it was a bit different for us. And, you know, we got Tim to do the vocal and, um, uh, yeah, it, it probably isn't at the, the normal tempo that we do. But having said that, we... Um, particularly on the earlier albums, like there was, um, there was definitely like slower tempo sort of tracks. Like I'm thinking of things like Blood on the Scales, um, in particular from, what album was Blood on the Scales on? Uh, Destined for Ascension. Um, I can't believe that I have to think about these things because like I was like right there <laughs> at the making of all these albums. But when you, when you've done quite a few over like a 20 year period, you do have to like just sort of you know, go into the the memory banks a bit um, to, to remember the track. But um, order your copy from Sound Mass. Um, check out the Power of Salvation video, lyric video on YouTube and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We have had a good number of new subscriptions in the last day. So thanks to all the new uh, YouTube subscribers checking out this channel. Uh, welcome. Welcome to the Grave Forsaken community. Um, like us on Facebook, like us on Instagram, like us on X, please. That would be great. The more the merrier. We just want everyone in this community. Grab some merchandise from Anchor Merchandising. This is my Footsteps of God shirt. Uh, but I've got I've got some Moment in Time merch on the way that I've ordered. So you can head over to Anchor Merchandising and, and find some cool Grave Forsaken Moment in Time merch. You know, get, get around this album. Um, we're just we're really happy with it, feel really blessed and just so pleased to have it out. Um, yeah, join our mailing list, subscribe to the podcast, you know, share our posts, like all that stuff. And, you know, thanks to the people who've been doing all that, you know, even liking and commenting, it helps. And then, you know, we've been getting new followers um, with, with the increased activity this year, you know, every, every day or so, like Facebook will tell me you have new followers and, um, Instagram the same and like every follower you know welcome it's it's like another you know another another person that we can share the message with and another person who can share can share great forsaken with other people because ultimately we're in this to, sp to spread the Christian message so we just want to really thank you um, for being for being involved um, just been a great year and um, yeah, it's very fitting that in our in our twentieth year we've um, we've done this. So um, I'm going to finish up there, and um, there's a few voices in the background, <laughs> um, so they're bleeding through. I apologise, but uh, yeah, happy Easter, um, happy moment in time release weekend, and until the next video update, God bless and rock on.